Here's the final part of 10 million mistakes in Veggie Tales. Number 41. So, in the town of Bethlehem, so we got Prince John who is stealing all of our hams. Aha! We get Veggie Tales. It's so freaking funny. You cracked me up because it, Beth, Bethlehem by the ham with Prince John stealing all of our hams. Aha! Very funny, we get it. Whoa! Number 42. If you could see right there, it says here Moby Dick. That is not appropriate, Veggie Tales. Give it the times. Dick is not a good word and blah blah blah. Don't have my book, Veggie Tales. Blah 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 blah. Number 43. Bob, you were wrong to give. Junior a uh, hero identity. You can't give kids hero identity kiddies because they're not as strong as grown ups, you know? And they'll easily die. So ordinary parents do not let kids be heroes. Wait until they're like eighteen or something. Number forty four. Okay, without the bricks on the con with bricks without concrete, these bricks should have fall down. The details this is so unrealistic. But Mr. Lund is staring at you, big idea. Number 45. What are water balloons and pies going to do to these? They won't even hurt them. It doesn't make sense, VeggieTales. Seriously, get more realistic with the bombs or something. Guns. Seriously, big idea. You suck nut. Number 46. How did these vegetables for they forget about God? Also... Do humans do exist in the world? Like, seriously, how did they forget about God? They're freaking Christian vegetables! They are Christian vegetables! Ah, oh, stupid story. Number 47. This... This episode is filled with references, and I'm just getting sick of it. I know they're kind of cute and all, but... They just throw in way too much, it kind of gets annoying, you know? A little bit annoying. And you're copying... You are you my neighbor? Uh, number forty-eight. This episode copies um the two thousand eleven's Muppets movie. No, really, it's about like getting the game back together because a person wants to destroy the park, is it destroy something, and then yeah, and trying to raise money for it and. And then the villain actually repays it. Repays it. I don't know, but he tells us it's a little lazy. Jim, Hen the Jim Henson Company should sue you. Yeah. Number forty nine. Bell just keeps telling the beat that he should get some lessons all the way, even if he doesn't want it. I gotta tell you. I would leave her alone. I will tell her I will leave her alone too. Mainly because she is so annoying and stuff. Yeah, he's thinking about it. Shut up. Shut up, Mirabelle. And her name is Mirabelle, sorry. No, and last up, number 50. How is doing Push-ups and getting a haircut now going to give you redesigns from the Netflix show. Also, Larry, Bob does not lo look nice. Also, another correction. How does an elephant fit on the countertop? Or why on earth, instead of why on earth, did you bring him on the countertop? This episode sucks, mainly because of its Netflix animation. It's getting pretty laggy, though. For the last time, you should be ashamed of yourselves, big idea. But anyway... If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, favorite, subscribe, retweet, re-Instagram it, suck my dick.